George and I'm planting the tree to honor my parents, George and Janet, and their legacy. My parents really taught all of us in the importance of giving back, of community, of participating and doing good. I'm planting this for my grandmother. I'm actually planting it for my family, my three grandbabies. I, I'm dedicating this to our co-workers, uh, our company. This one looks, looks beautiful. <laughs> Did you notice the heart shape? Reminds me of, of the love that I have for my wife. I love you, Cookie. Aloha. I like the idea of restarting the native plants back to the uh, to the land. When all of this was sugarcane plantations, the sugarcane plants absorbed all the soil right. uh, nutrients out of the ground, right? So you can actually see this is what's here, and it's just so dry. Because if you're walking around, you see all the big cracks and crevices that happen. The reason that's happened is because of the sugarcane mm. and the halicola. So those are two plants that really have a lot of negative impact on the soil. And so what's really amazing as we planted these trees, the ground is actually healing. So it's From actually, these plants. Mm -hmm. So these trees between the Milo and the Co, they're just doing better for the land. Yeah. So what's so cool is by giving the plants that do good to the soil, the other things will grow better and heal and do better as well. So it's actually been a really amazing thing to see. Yeah. I've seen firsthand. We're very excited to partner with Hawaii Legacy. From a company point of view, so we have our team that's able to come up and actually physically plant these, these trees and, and honor the people that are important to them. But also it's a way for us to get our customers involved to allow this whole project to flourish. It's particularly fitting to be here in Hawaii where family and giving back is so ingrained in the culture and learning about the sustainability of this forest and the way that it will continue to grow and give back over the years. It feels wonderful and it is a special place, special people and really an honor to be a part of it. I love the healing that it's able to create for the island and the team effort that I can see all around with the company and even in the short period of time, just in a couple of years, that it's already starting to make such a large impact overall. So why did you pick your tree? I always root for the underdog, so small but mighty. You know, at first, when you know, you, you're you just watching everybody plant a tree until you actually plant it yourself. You know, just the, the mana and the spirit and all the memories just come right into, you know, what you're doing and you're thinking about this, this beautiful plan and, this is special. I knew that this would be a really cool experience. And sometimes when you face um, immortality, unexpectedly you realize how beautiful everything is on this planet. And so when the opportunity came for us to partner with the Legacy for it was the perfect match. Because everything we can do to take care of the land and to take care of each other, it's, it's a beautiful thing. Um, there's something about putting something living to honor someone who's passed. And to know that it's gonna continue and, and grow and it just feels really good. want to say anything more, we're just going to give our tree its first drink of water. And that's where life starts. And that's where life starts. Grand beginnings, huh? Yep.